Hi there, fellow shapes enthusiasts. My name is Bins, and I welcome you to the first video in a new series um, that is about something I have been looking forward to a long time, and that is the Shapes Industries mod. Um, shapes Industries is possibly, probably, uh, one of the biggest and most well-known and especially most game-changing mods out there. And at the while at the moment of recording this video, it has been out for a few months, I have purposefully put it off uh, because I wanted to finish, you know, other projects first, like uh, the, the Bust Mam series. Um, so I am going to do something I haven't done before, which is a kind of Let's play. Let's play Shapes in this Industries. Let's record it together uh, and explore this this mod that has nothing but good, um, you know, good reviews. Let's explore it together. Right now, I have no idea how long um, how long I'll be playing for. I have no idea how long this video is going to be. I have no idea how much editing I'm going to have to do because I have never done this before. Now, I have honestly not looked at Shapes Industries at all yet. I have some idea about what to expect from, you know, being on the Discord and people talking about it, but I have never installed this mod before and opened a game. So that's what we're going to do together. So I'm going to go in fully blind and I'm going to discover with you what this mod is all about. So let's start a new game and see what happens, shall we? New Shapes Industry save is designed to be played with a new save. But as the mod assumes you already know the basic mechanics, I advise you to finish the base game first. Yeah, of course, we have that under our belts. Note that this is a complete revamp of the Shapes IO experience. Using other mods will either break the game or ruin the experience. Yeah, I have been warned about that. So Shapes Industries is in fact incompatible with most other mods because depending on your point of view, you could say that Shapes Industries is basically a game or a game mode by itself. Now, I do know that there are some mods that are compatible with, uh, with that, but right now I have no other mods installed. So, okay, that's fine. Continue. And we are in a new game that at first glance seems to look like the regular game. So, Let's get some... Okay, we've completed level one. Let's get to the next level. This still looks pretty much the same. Okay, nothing new so far, so let's get the cutter in. I'm just going to, you know, start over. Start over, one, two, three, four. Let's do four, and then we're gonna go uh, one, two, three, four. Sure, why not? You go in there, you go in there, you go there, you go there. And then we have to cut away the, uh, the right part. There we go. So nothing new so far. Okay, now we need square. So this is the base game so far. Let me have a look at the... Um, at the at the settings to see if there's anything you know if there's anything regarding that user interface performance advanced key bindings yeah i can't really 
Okay, so currently we just have we, we just seem to have the base game and not much else. So all right, let's get some squares in. Oh, we have the balancer. So let's do that. Okay, let's go there. Speed this up a bit. You can now research speed upgrades. Okay, these are our upgrades. We know that. So I noticed that the um, yeah the upgrades change a bit because in my recollection stars haven't been something that we needed before. Let's get that in. Let's get that in. Two, three, four, five balancers. Okay, that's that. Do we have the rotator yet? No, we don't, so we still need to trash some stuff. And what is the side I need to trash? Is this left or right? Right, okay, so we trash this and this and this and this. Then we get you going. Oh, you really don't need a lot of um, a lot of throughput. You only need thir thirty. <clears throat> you know what? As long as this game is close to the to the uh, to the base game, I am going to just skip this. I think because it will be it will be a bit boring to watch. Okay. Um, yeah, we could just rotate this, I guess. And then do it like so. Oh, right. Uh, we can... Rotate that as well, can't we? There we go. That's a lot better. Okay, there it is. And I guess we will also be wanting to work on our upgrades a bit, right? So let's uh, let's find some stars on the map. Here we have some stars. Let's get a lot of those in. One, two, three, four, five. Let's get them onto one single belt. There we go. And now we're just gonna move that into the hub. There we go. Here. Good. Now I don't know yet how this is going to play out. I'm just going to delete this for the time being and let's get to work on our next um on our next shape. So one, two, three, four, why not? Let's cut this out. Get this done, and then there you go, there you go. We need to rotate this or otherwise it won't make sense. Let's see. Let's get some more stuff in. And now we need to rotate that. We only have the regular rotator. We need the top left. So that is one, two, three. Uh, just one and one, two. There we go. There we go. There we go. And that should be good, I guess, right? Well, heck, let's do another one. Is it worth it? No, I'm just gonna... Just gonna wait and fast forward a bit. Okay, those are our upgrades. Hey, new upgrade. Okay, let's do speed. We've unlocked the painter, that's great. 
let's see about that upgrade. What else are we getting? Maximum speed level? Okay. Unlock upgrades tier 3 from a hub level to progress further. I do not know what that means yet. But in any way, we need... We need painted quadrants, I guess. Uh, painted circles. So let's do that. How, we need, how much we need? 80? Yeah, so we're not gonna... I'm not gonna exaggerate. Just gonna build a very small... Very simple setup right here. There we go. Boom, boom. And boom, boom, boom. There we go. And there we go. And then some circles. So I hope you realize I'm not going for full efficiency here. You know, it's... it's been a long time since I played with the game, but I do have some recollection of how to build these setups uh, with, you know, if you don't have all of the all of the proper uh, things yet, all of the all of the units yet. So let's see, unlock upgrades from tier three. Unlock upgrades tier 3 from a hub level to progress further. I do not know what that means, to be honest. Unlock... I don't know what... I don't know what it means. So, why is this not working? Oh, of course. Okay, I guess this will work. Yeah, I'm just gonna set it out. I'm not gonna invest time in building another thing, because by the time it's built, we probably have the 80 units anyway. Complete level 10 to unlock, unlock bug prints. I don't know if that's a typo, or whether bug prints is something... Is actually a different feature from the blueprints? We'll see. Alright, Mixer has been unlocked. So, so far it seems like... You know, the, the base game, this is just a simplified version of the base game. And then maybe in free play things will get... Quirky, I don't know. So we need yellow half, um, half, half, half uh, um, squares. So let's look at that. Let's get a patch. Uh, I guess I'll just stay close to the hub. So here we go. This looks good. So let's just go one, two, three, four, five. That is our yellow color, and now we're going to get that into a painter array. How much of this do we need? Well, not too many, so I'm just going to build like one, two, three, four, let's say. I guess that'll do. So... That's that, and now we wait. So, let's see if we have some new upgrades. No, not yet. Okay, so we just wait for this step then. All right. This looks more like we're gonna get down to business. So, let's have a look at the level nine shape. 
This is a new shape I haven't encountered before. And Unlock Research is also something that is not in the base game. So, let's... Um, well, I'm gonna keep this line, because we, we can use the yellow for sure. And then we need uh, white as well, so let's get white in. Let's find a patch of blue, red and green close together. Maybe not too far away, because we don't have many of the, um, of the upgrades yet, and the belts take forever. But, uh, let's go one, two, three, four, five for green, one, two, three. Four, five, four, blue. Uh, and since we're gonna pair that up with five of these, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna send them in one by one, instead of, you know, the entire merging and balancing thing. Okay, I have to, <laughs> I have to rethink my choices here. <laughs> just, <laughs> just a sec. Did we get the uh, the mergers yet? No, we didn't, so we're gonna make this a balancing act. Or are we gonna? No, we're not gonna. We're just gonna do the exact same thing once again. One, two, three, four, five. There we go, now we have that. And now we need to get that into our circles. So, do we have any circles in the vicinity? Yes, we do, and we're gonna make that a full-time, a full-type thing, so... Uh, one, two, three, four, five... Let's say six there. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two... No, that has to be the other side. I'm getting a bit rusty. One, two, three, four. Five, six. And then we're gonna have to move that into some cutters. One, two, you know what I'm gonna do actually? I'm gonna I'm gonna turn it into eight cutters. Ratio-wise, that is usually not the smart thing to do. But I think. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, that's good. Um, I think it's gonna pay. It's gonna play out well. So let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Then we're gonna get that. And now, let's see. One. Oh, this might be interesting, actually. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. And one, two, three, four. So the thing I probably want to do is get that cut. I think I, I was a bit optimistic with the space I'd need. So we're going to have to move those up a bit. Okay, now, um, now we need to get the rotations in. I believe that's good. So, yeah, that looks fine. That looks fine. That looks good. So, that's that. And now I believe we can repeat this. So, there we go. I think we're good, right? Are we good? I think we're good. I 
I actually have no idea how many belts I am creating at the moment. Probably way too many. I am exaggerating a bit, but it's what we'll do. So now I need another painting array. And there we have it. That is our... That will be our yellow thing. And now, um... Let's create our staggers here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, I exaggerated way too much. But that's fine, that's fine. Everything is fine. Now, I do feel like I kind of messed up here, haven't I? Because these things aren't moving. I don't know why they're not moving. But the bottom line is, I, dis I don't really care that much. I feel like, because... You know, I am just trying to get to this research thing. I want to know what that's about. So let's get our yellow circles in. We're gonna get those up here. They're going to meet with that stuff. So now we should be good to go. Um, stackers. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That's one. That's for the um, yellow. That's not high enough, is it? So. One, two, three, four, five. Five, six, seven, eight. And now, tunnels. Yeah. That should be good. Alrighty then. How much of these do we need? Oh, 200. I am way too, you know, I have exaggerated this a ton, I feel like. So, they have to be stacked on top, therefore that has to be the right input. There we go. And now, one, two, no. Hold on. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And there we go. Sheesh, finally. That took me a sweet time. Please tell me we have the thing, right? We have the thing? Yes, we have the thing. Finally. And now we can put that into the hub. And we have our thing. Great. Do we get a full belt of that stuff? I don't know. Honestly, I have no idea why these things aren't moving. Like, why aren't they doing anything? Am I missing something here? Am I... What am I missing? Why do these belts not move? Is there like an issue of sorts? Honestly, I don't know. I don't know why these belts aren't moving. You could tell me in the comments. Um, probably you see it, but I don't. I'm not seeing it. I don't know why these belts are not moving. That's fine because my belt is full anyway. So we're just gonna wait. We're, we're at the goal anyway. So, okay. I guess this is fine. And then research. All right, congratulations. You have unlocked the first new main mechanic in Shapes Industries. Research, 
With research, you no longer unlock variants from the hub. Instead, you can unlock them in the research tab, a new tab in the top right of your screen. Each tier of research has a unique shape that is required to research it, starting with the shape you just delivered. Make sure to remember to research variants as they are very useful. All right. So let's have a look at this research tab. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. We have a lot here. Smart merger. Extractor, chain extractor, quad cutter, counterclockwise rotator, double painter. Okay, that's from the main game. Um, smart splitter is new. The deep miner seems to be new. I don't know what that does. Laser cutter. Corner crossing, line crossing, smart tunnel. I have no idea what the smart tunnel is. Layer painter and mini storage. Okay. Well, there is a lot to um, a lot to uncover here. Right. Okay. Have we unlocked anything new? We're gonna get bug prints. Okay. Okay, I feel like if this is going to be an upgrade shape, then, um, yeah, I'm going to have to go about this in a smarter way. So, this setup, I am probably going to get rid of it, and off-camera, I'm going to make, you know, something more robust and efficient, if this is a shape that we're going to need. And then, we, we are going to have to start on this shape right okay you know what um i think i'm gonna leave it here for this episode this first let's play in the following um in the following episode we will have i will i will build something new for this right i'm going to wait yeah i need i will be needing to build all of these things maybe i'll do that off camera too i don't know but then on camera, we're going to build a machine for this thing. Okay? So, um, hey, I hope you enjoyed. I, uh, I'm really looking forward to seeing what Shapes Industries has to offer. I feel like uh, this first part has been a bit boring because it was basically nothing new from the main game anyway. But as of the next, um, as of level 10, I feel like with the research thing, we are definitely going to get into some new territory. So, um, thank you for watching. Uh, I hope you um, I hope you stick around for the second part. And of course, if you want to see more of this, then uh, feel free to uh, to subscribe to the channel. For today, I am out. Thank you for watching. Have a lovely day. Take care. Bye bye.